David, more people attended Oregon Ballet Theater shows this season than during any other across OBT's 35 year history. They credit efforts to revitalize the city for bringing more people downtown, especially those who've missed the Grace, beauty, and gratitude. As their season winds down, Oregon Ballet Theater is celebrating a milestone. This is the greatest season we have ever had in our 35 year history. 92,000 audience attendees and $4.7 million in ticket sales. That's a grand jeté over OBT's second best season in 2017. 7,000 more attendees and a million more in sales. For executive director Shane Jewell, that's something in a post-pandemic world. It doesn't mean we're out of the woods, we're still rebuilding, uh, but this is certainly a win for us and we're thrilled about it. There just seems to be a lot of sense of hope uh, and momentum that something special is happening at the ballet and, and people want to be part of it. Jewell says since the pandemic, audience tastes have shifted. A little like comfort food, he says they're seeking what's familiar. It's why they focused this season on the classics like Swan Lake, Peter Pan, and their annual run of the Nutcracker. Also, Jewel says they're seeing more kids and families. There's no one I know that works in the arts that doesn't have a story about a show they saw when they were a kid that changed their lives. There's something different about experiencing art as a group, as a community. Stephanie Chadwick is director of marketing for OBT. She says part of this audience infusion stems from a bigger effort to revitalize downtown. Yeah, I believe in Portland 110%. Absolutely believe in Portland and I want to be part of the change. And so that's one of the reasons why I work at Oregon Ballet Theater. OBT has one more show this season. It's called Made in Portland. The showcase of contemporary works opens Thursday here at the Newmark Theater on Southwest Broadway. As for OBT's anchor stage at Keller Auditorium, its future is up in the air. The city is currently deciding whether to rebuild it or build a new theater, either at PSU or Lloyd Center. Jewel says OBT is not endorsing any one proposal. Very much looking forward to a decision being made so that we can all move forward together. For now, I am excited for this next season. And maybe a new sales record. Either way, they dance. In downtown Portland, Katherine Cook, KGW News.